uh, projects that we've done videos on are multi-multi-million dollar projects as we're rehabilitating our sewers and our interceptors, etc. But some are a little bit smaller. This one is a little bit smaller, maybe a middle, mid-sized project. But very important because it's a critical component of our overall infrastructure. And I'm joined today with uh, Steve Downey, who's our construction engineer, and uh, Keith Luma, who does all of our inspection on all of our various projects. And uh, these two guys are out here, obviously, the project managers of this particular project. We are at 23 Mile and Faith in Macomb Township. And we are rehabilitating and redoing a meter, what we call a meter rehab, uh, for our pipe, our sewer interceptor that runs all the way up Hayes. And as I say, we're at 23 in Hayes. This, this pipe runs all the way up to Washington Township, which is part of our uh, cooperative here, what we call the MID, uh, the Macomb Interceptor Drainage District. So they are one of the 11 communities where the local communities feed into our main interceptor. And one of the things that we need to do is be able to have our, our meters, our billing area, quite frankly, where we're able to see how much flow is coming from a particular community. Uh, and then, uh, you know, everybody gets billed. As you know, everyone's got to pay sewage bills. And we need to make sure that those meters are working properly and that the uh, area where the meter is located uh, it also needs work. These things were put in many, many, many years ago and there really hasn't been an upgrade to them. Uh, and they need to be maintained. So uh, Keith does all the inspection to make sure that everything that's being done uh, on our project is being done right. If the taxpayers are getting uh, the good, the best bang for their buck, that these things last a long time, that the work's done properly, etc. But first I'm going to ask Steve to tell you uh, from an engineer what exactly is happening here. Thanks, Candace. So what we're out here doing today is, uh, as Candace mentioned, we have the flow that comes in the Washington Township sewer into a flow meter, and there we measure that flow with uh, with a laser flow meter before it gets into the interceptor, and that's how we bill Washington Township. We do the same thing in all of our other communities as well. And um, over time, the connecting sewer and the drop manholes are subjected to uh, H2S attack and other various uh, components that cause degradation. So what we're in the process of doing today is rehabilitating or today we have a major task going on to rehabilitate that. The connecting sewer, we're doing uh, what's called cured in place pipe, CIPP. And um, that liner is a, a essentially a bag that the contractor has pulled through the connecting sewer and they're inflating it with water and they're gonna go through the curing process. And what that cured in place pipe is going to do is extend the useful life of the sewer. It's gonna give us a protective barrier against future H2S uh, attack and corrosion issues. Once we get done with the connecting sewer rehab, we have two drop manholes, and we're gonna do some spray applied lining to give a nice protective barrier that'll extend the useful life of these systems and protect the integrity for, for many years to come. So that's what we have going on out here today. Um, there's a lot of equipment. We have some lane closures. We are bypass pumping this facility to, to uh, coordinate this work. So there's a, there's a lot involved. It's not a huge project, but it's big enough that it's, uh, it's quite visible. Yeah, I think that really tells you exactly what's happening here. I don't know if you want to add anything, Keith. There's not much more I can add. Steve pretty much covered it all. He covered it all. Okay. Well, we have a great uh, team in place out here, and uh, the contractor is doing really great work. Obviously, we put together all the design specifications. We did everything out. We are completely transparent, accountable. Anybody that wants to see any of these good documents, you certainly could. Uh, and then, of course, we have our inspectors that are out on all the sites as well. And that is really a very important thing, right? you got to make sure uh, that whatever we're spending the taxpayers, the ratepayers' money on, that the project is done, you know, at the best price that we can get. But price is not always the only thing we look at. Of course, we look at the price. We look at the quality of the work to make sure that uh, who we get to do this, that this stuff is not going to fall apart after we're done doing it right away has to last a generation, so that's where the inspectors come in to make sure that everything that's being placed into these, uh, these different projects is being done uh, properly. So we thought you might be interested to, to hear about this. This is uh, just a, one of the components of all of our uh, underground. And here in Macomb County, we are totally focused 
on making sure that the existing infrastructure that we already paid a lot of money for is going to be able to be maintained properly. We inspect it on a regular basis. We're maintaining it as needed. We have a capital improvements uh, project program, uh, and we're, uh, we have the plan, and we're working the plan. So thanks for joining us.